Hey guys, it's Flank Runk here, and we are back with some more XCOM 2. And when we left off in the last episode, we were fighting off uh, a retaliation attempt by Advent against one of our uh, neighboring rebel cells, whatever you want to call them. And it was in Mexico. Let's go back to the map. Now, this is where we just defended the site, so... And... Charlie and or, 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 or Ryan or Frodo, as I like to call him, um, got wounded by a nice plasma grenade, but no one died. They came close, but uh, that kind of put them out of action for a little bit. Now, as I said in the last uh, episode, we were kind of waiting on getting more power up so I can also make more uh, communications comms, and then we would uh, advance out of the U.S. But until then, I'm kind of just moving around the U.S., getting items that I can get my hands on. Like these soldiers, for example. I am sure oh, will find the wow, right before. As intriguing as I do, Commander. Having care? An extensive study Tygen, did you, uh, just, just, I'll read your report. Tygen, Tygen, shut up. Tygen, 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 I get it. Tygen, Tygen, shut up. Tygen, Tygen, I'll let you talk. Genetic material. Anyways. Having carefully studied what remains of Dr. Valen's personal research reports, I will slowly come to the understanding of the depths of her intellectual curiosity and the degree to which she was consumed by her ambition. By reversing her changes to the Viper's genetic structure, traits intelligent, intentionally suppressed by the aliens, she created this subject, Gamma, the Viper King. The idea of a Viper patriarch is in itself intriguing, considering there have been no previous sightings of any males of the species. Valen memorized this may have been an intentional form of population control. The elders have restricted their subordinate species' ability to breed, having seen the apparent nesting site created by Gamma and the discovery of the egg's clutches, none of which were left viable for sampling. I can say with some confidence that the creature did immediately set out to pursue the natural instinct that had long since been restrained through genetic tampering. As of yet, I have no explanation as to how the viper's venom glands were affected in such a way as to change their form and function so that dramatically... Furtherly study, uh, further study will be necessary, but I've promised to allow some of the Gamma's remains to be utilized towards a conceptual armor design. Ooh, codename Scorpion. Serpent suits. The scale Viper King are surprisingly lightweight and flexible, should provide substantial resistance once reformed. Alright, so that's part of the DLC. I guess I can apply the, um, the creature's autopsy to make better equipment. Kind of makes sense. Now... I want to... Not weapons. We're gonna... I don't want to work on the armor. It's not ready yet. Mmm... Uh, we'll do... Mmm... What do to do... Advent Stun Lancer Advent Autopsy. Stun Lan and then we're gonna back off. I've started to wonder how the Advent Administration views our current band of renegades. Do they uh, see probably not too well. Actual threat or more of a nuisance? Anyways, guys, I noticed that I have the nice unstaffed engineer um, alert, so I'm going to go and send uh, uh, the, the, the Ann Crawford to do more excavation. And we opened up a building area. Now, I can build. I need to build a power relay first, which costs me 80 supplies. I don't have that. And then I can build my resistance comms and increase my, um, the amount of uh, the, the, the contacts I can have. However, first, let's gonna get the soldiers, then we'll head over to the black markets. Yep. Oh, we got Corporal Emma Carlson, sharpshooter. Nice. Now, there's some... Oh, shoot. Uh, I didn't click on anything. I was just moving the map. We were gonna go there. But, uh... But that wasn't the point. And they're gonna sell some stuff so I can, uh, get some supplies. Uh, laser sight. Ooh, that's right, it's some good weapon. Uh, da, 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 da. <clears throat> Valerium cores. I want to save those. Baseless. Viper. Got four Vipers. We could always, uh... We'll sell... A, oh, wait. We'll sell a couple Vipers. Get some ten there. And then auto-reload. Advanced laser sights. Med kits. Do, 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 do. Uh, I'm gonna keep the mutants. I need the mech for the autopsy because we only got one mech. Hmm. Uh, we'll sell one officer, and uh, we'll sell these like, three of those troopers, and I think that's enough so I can build the the power relay. 
Now we're going to back out again. Sorry, guys. I'm doing a lot of switching between the map and the inside of the ship. I just want to... Ooh, armory. Look, what's going on over here? View soldier. Oh, right. Because we got Emma, so I got to give her her upgrades. Nice to get another sniper. We're going to promote her. And I... Do I need to go gunslinger? Oh, we're going to go sniper this time as well. And uh, loadout. Sniper reach. Uh, SR-599. Now back off. Now, what was I doing before? Alright, we're gonna build that power relay. It's so like... Power yeah, I got it. Thank you. Once I get my, uh, engineer off that excavation, I'll have him speed up the process. But, anyways, we're gonna go, and we're gonna grab... Well, there's supplies over here, so I might as well go grab for those. Or grab those before. since I started. And these are limited time, like, supplies will still be there. So. Skulljack's done. Thank you. Oh, wait, I wonder. Hold on. Go back to the Proving Grounds. I know, guys. Again, sorry. I'm jumping back and forth. He's not currently building anything. Uh. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna... Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Hold on. Uh, we're gonna empty the person working here. And I'm gonna start... Actually, I'm gonna move them to the Power Relay. Yep. And then back off. And then we're going to go to the clearing, which I need to also reassign because I, I screwed that up. So we're going to put Ann Crawford back er, there. Oh, sorry. All right. That should be good. Power will be up in six days. And I got five to do this uh, destroyed convoy supplies. Oh. Chad has recovered. Mackenzie has recovered. Uh... All right. The outcome of this research can only. This is gonna be one of those just episodes where it's like a lot of stuff just happening at once. Ooh, a new weapon for uh, Walter. Unruly civilians within the city. Since he's the only one who has the axe. It seems they have come to rely on more brutal means of pacification in the time since. Hmm. Uh, we'll do the mech. These robotic. And back to the map. All right, one day to finish up these supplies. Strategic resource 58 supplies, not too bad, I'd say. Now we're going to go get that engineer. New and then hopefully by the time we'll have power up and other things are sorted. And then we could hopefully very soon either we'll get a mission or we'll get them. Dark event completes. Okay, advent cracks down our resistance. Recruitment increases the cost of recruits by 100%. Crud. So that means every recruit, so usually recruits, so if I want to... Thank you, uh, view facility. When I go to recruit people, they're like 25 supplies to recruit. Now they're going to be 50 for like a month's time. So, power relay, we increase our power by like... Uh, da, 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 by three. Uh, I can man that relay with uh, engineer to increase that power. And I can also like upgrade their thing. I might just use the engineer I get to uh, man that so we get more power. And put the other ones on just finish, uh, clearing. Of course, mission. Coming message for you, Commander. Oh no. Through to your quarters now. You have made considerable. Uh, I'll reveal this dark event. Aliens, over the aliens hide an ambush among the populace. That your ongoing Why does everyone? I, I want to talk. I, I can't have these guys talking. God, all the time. Anyways, the aliens hide an ambush among the populace, placing hidden faceless, faceless aliens on each mission for the month. That actually would be quite annoying. New construction set up the, uh, reduces the alien facility counter by two weeks. Avatar project major breakthrough. Alien scientists make a huge amount of progress in the Avatar project, instantly adding two blocks of progress. Oh boy. So I guess not the faceless, but there's also the major breakthrough, which I might need this. The two of these are affect affecting the, the counter, which is an issue. So let's get this engineer. Please don't give me a missionary. I want to get the engineer and assign him. Dr. Esmeralda Perez, we're going to hit OK. We're going to back off. But hold on, just be quiet. Not think I could have predicted this outcome, though it is intriguing. Now we're going to The lab is currently oh, shut up. Valuable time and resources by not conducting any research. I got Please it. Please consider providing us okay. with directive as soon as Yes, possible. yes, Tygen, I get it. I, I, I get it. You're awesome people. You got problems. Let's me do this. 
They're fully automated at Central Office. They they're also needy guys. I just understand. Like seriously. Anyways. Uh, let's get these supplies. I can start building more contact spots. Hopefully, we get a mission. I know you guys usually come to permissions, but this is also I find kind of important just to know. Oh my God, this is just what it is. Do 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 do. Hmm. We gotta build uh resistance comms. Resistance communications facility construction initiated. Yeah, thank you, Anne. And then we got someone manning. Perfect. And we have collected all the resources from this location. The resistance should provide us with additional supplies in a few weeks. Fly back to Resistance HQ. We'll ignore that. Actually, well, they have new staff, so let's go check that out. Course for Sector 9, Western United States. Welcome, Commander. Scientists. So we can get an engineer or a scientist. I have the supplies for it. However, I'm not feeling I need to spend the supplies on that at this current time. Uh, I, in fact, I want to increase my weaponry. Do inventory. Nope. Build items. Weapons. Wait, is there better armor I can... No. Well, this is nanoscale, which is kind of nice, but... Anyways, let's head down. Enhanced Shadow Keeper. Ionic Axe. Uh, Ionic Axe. Shadow Keeper. And... The Helix Railgun? Or Rail Cannon? Yeah, we'll do the Rail Cannon. And... The DMR, right, because these are all the base games. Well, the, the M7 caseless SMG isn't. I might use it, because it allows you to shoot twice with it, which is kind of nice. Um, that's, like, the difference between this one Halo skin. It kind of lets you use twice, but I don't have the allies to build it anyways. Our magnetic rifle, back pistol, reach DMR, and shard gun. Yeah, okay. Uh, I need to build Gremlin at some point. But, yeah. All right, so I think that's that. Colonies for a few years before linking up with Central, right? Yes, one of the advantages of working with Advent. On the surface, you soldiers. But there was a price for that comfort. The millions of people in those cities don't seem to mind all that much. Yes, but Advent is always watching. Between their forces. I don't care about the conversation at all, really. Well, while we're passing the time, well, okay, they're going to increase the Avatar project. Commander, the aliens continue to make progress on the Avatar project. If we're going to slow them down, we'll need to move fast. Man, just clicking information. Commander, the aliens have made significant progress. New facility. Interesting. New Advent facilities are cropping up around the world. Okay, guys. Um, I'm seeing that I've kind of spent a lot of time just messing around with things. So what we're, what's going to happen is this episode, as you're going to see, and I'm not saying it now, is going to be... Posted in between, like it's gonna be considered an episode of XCOM, but it's gonna be like a build up to uh, the next one. So I'll make sure to put a, a message in front of this one. But um, yeah, so what's gonna happen is I'm gonna end this here. I'm gonna mark the video as like a, as the in between, whatever. And then when you guys come back, join me in the next episode. I'll make sure to post these on the same day. Next episode, uh, we'll actually enter this mission. So I'll see you guys in. Very much a few moments.